morning students today we are going to discuss about database objects so in this we are going to discuss sql view index clusters sequence and snanium so first of all we are going to discuss about sql views so a view is a custom tailored presentation of data from one or more tables a view is nothing but a stored query a view is like a window through which data on a table can be viewed or changed it is a virtual table so it does not have any data of its own so syntax for creating a view is the syntax is create view view name as select column list from table name where condition so in this syntax a view name is the name of the view the select statement is used to define the columns and rows that you want to display in the view for example create view view product as select product id product name from product a view can be drop using a drop view syntax the syntax is drop view view name see the example drop view st stu underscore view so here stu underscore is a view through this command we can drop the view second uh, we move on to index sql index a index in sql is created on existing table to retrieve the rows quickly so when there are thousands of records in a table retrieving information will take a long time therefore index are created on columns which are accessed frequently so that the information can be retrieved quickly index can be created on single columns or a group of columns so when an index is created automatically it assign row id for each row the syntax for creating an index is create index index name on table name with a bracket column name 1 column name 2 like that we can have n number of columns the above syntax index name is the name of the index table name is the name of the table to which the index columns belongs then column 1 column 2 is the list of columns which make up the index there are two types of index namely implicit index and explicit index implicit index are created when a column is explicitly defined with the primary key or unique key constraint whereas explicit index are created using the create index syntax so like view index also uh, dropped from the memory the syntax is drop index index name for example drop index e name index e name underscore index so when you give a command like this the e name index will be removed from the memory next we move on to clusters so clusters also used for fast retrieval of information it is also improve the performance of fast retrieval of data from the table clusters clusters can be created using create cluster command the syntax is create cluster cluster name column name followed by data types for example create cluster dpt underscore emp cluster with a bracket the field name dm uh, dpt number number of two clusters can also be uh, removed from the memory using the command drop cluster cluster name for example drop cluster d dept underscore emp cluster the fourth one is a sequence a sequence is a database object used to generate unique integers for use as primary keys a sequence is created through a create sequence command 
sequence also can be altered and drop so when there is a uh, when a table doesn't have any primary key we can create a sequence the syntax is create sequence sequence name increment by n start with m maximum n or uh, no maximum value minimum value no minimum value cycle and no cycle catch and no catch so except create sequence sequence name all other uh, options are optional parameters so here the sequence name is the name of the sequence n is the increment value specified by the user the default for the increment is 1 the user can specify the increment start with is the number with which the sequence will begin minimum value sequence will generate lower bound the default is 1 for ascending sequence and 10e27 minus 1 for descending sequence max value provides upper bound for sequence default is 1 for descending sequence and 10e27 minus 1 for ascending sequence for example create sequence emp number incremented by 1 starts with 1000 so sequence is also removed from the memory using drop sequence command the syntax is drop sequence sequence name for example drop sequence emp number the last one is snanm a snanm is an alias name for a table view index etc since a snanm is nothing but an alias it requires no storage other than its definition snanms are often used for security and convenience the syntax is create snanm snanm name for object name for example create snanm emp sys for emp the above example will create a snanm call emp sys for employee